March 27th, the fourth week of Lent, and today's Gospel. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to John. Jesus moved about within Galilee, and he did not wish to travel in Judea, because the Jews were trying to kill him. For the Jews, Jewish Feast of Tabernacles was near. But when his brothers had gone up to the feast, he himself also went up, not openly, but as it were, in secret. Some of the inhabitants of Jerusalem said, Is he not the one they are trying to kill? And look, he is speaking openly, and they say nothing to him. Could the authorities have realized that he is the Christ? But we know where he is from. When Christ comes, no one will know where he is from. So Jesus cried out in the temple area as he was teaching and said, You know me and also where I am from? <laughs> Yet I did not come on my own, but the one who sent me, whom you do not know, is true. I know him, because I am from him, and he sent me. So they tried to arrest him, but no one laid a hand upon him, because his hour had not come yet. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Well, what I'm doing my time, part of my time during these days, is I'm trying to call each parishioner. That's about a thousand people. You say, well, it's a lot of people, but I'm afraid I'm going to have a lot of time. So I don't have to worry trying to get it done within a few days. So if you get a call from me, don't be surprised. Just want to check in and see how you're doing. Well, at the end of the day, I called one of our parishioners. I believe her name was Jean. And I called, I think she thought I was calling just she alone. She thanked me and said, well, my husband, I think he just had a procedure and he's doing okay, but he needs my prayers. And then she said, thank you for calling me. Calling me. She said, it means so much to me. I was beginning to feel like that no one was thinking of me, that we're all forgotten. If we had today's spiritual responsorial psalm, the Lord said, the response was this, the Lord is close to the brokenhearted. The Lord is close to the brokenhearted. So even if we didn't get any mail or email or text or phone call, we are never, never forgotten, especially and our own suffering, our own pain, our trials and challenges. Because even human people may forget about us, we we'll get caught up in the own world, their own life. The Lord is close to the brokenhearted. You don't have to be in church. Even at your own home, you can call upon the Lord and he's with you. So please don't feel abandoned. Dig deep in your faith and in your trials and your challenges. Know this one truth, that the Lord is always close to the brokenhearted. God bless you. Have a beautiful day.